My name is Lisa Sekaja and I am the co-founder of Phenomena Women Global. This is an organization that was a passion of mine and founded because of the need to empower women into leadership positions and the need to ensure gender equality in line with SDG 5 of the Sustainable Development Goals. I decided to create a safe space where women could discuss challenges they felt in moving up in the job market and see how as women we could empower each other and draw on each other's strengths in order for us to lead better lives and be fulfilled in our careers and our personal lives. This led to the first Phenomenal Women Conference in Geneva in 2018. This was a launch that drew 150 women. And the conference was structured in such a way that women from diverse backgrounds were able to discuss how they made it in their professions, who mentored them, and what tools they used to succeed in their life journey. In that respect, we had women, for example, uh, in business, women founders of NGOs, uh, women in health, and the conferences also had a component, which is very important, group discussions on issues that affect women's daily lives, like finances, health, social and legal problems that women face. And within this group discussion, speakers would share specific information on financial planning, for instance. Um, how do you plan for a family? How do you plan for your life? How do you budget? How do you invest? And uh, on top of that, there was also women's health discussed because this is very important. In order for you to grow both professionally and personally, you have to have good health. That in order for women to grow and achieve their full potential, they should have a multifaceted and a multidimensional outlook to their lives and ensure that not only their careers or their professional development is advancing, but also that they have success in their health, mental well-being, work-life balance and family life. And so these conferences embody a whole range of issues that help women thrive and survive as they walk through their life. Friendships are formed at these conferences. Networks are made at these conferences. A lot of people have gotten a job contract or a business partner because of this conference that draws so many women from different backgrounds. After the 2018 conference in Geneva, we successfully organized a 2018 conference in Uganda with the Human Rights Center. This led to a domino effect where more conferences were being held in different countries. So it has become an annual trend because women have realized that united we're stronger. It doesn't matter where you live, who you are, what profession you are. And Phenomenal Women Global is an intergenerational and interdisciplinary organization. We do have inspirational speakers as well who come to each and every conference to inspire people on different aspects, whether it's leadership, whether it's success, whether it's spirituality. It's very important to believe in yourself and have confidence in yourself. It's also important to write down your goals in order to achieve them. And lastly, one thing I can say is learning never stops. Continue to attend different capacity building events. Now with COVID-19, there are new challenges that have come out, new ways of working. So people have taken things online. Invest in technology so you can do things much better. I would encourage the human rights defenders to continue the fight, protection and promotion of human rights. And be the face for other women that are facing hardships. We know that the pandemic has um, created an increase in gender-based violence in so many spheres and in so many countries. So we ask that human rights defenders deal with the pressing issues uh, that women are facing currently because of the pandemic.